This is for Cancer, some rising the Venus signs. This is for Cancer. My name is the Reader the Mean Eyes here for those of y'all that are new. And welcome to the Mean Eyes channel, y'all. Let's see what's coming in for Cancer. So we have purity. We have always trust in purity of your heart. Look inside of your heart and within you will find the answers that you are questioning. And then we also have shine from within. So we have looks can be deceiving. True beauty shines from within. So it might not appear what it appears. To, it might not be what it appears to be. Cancer, trust the process and we got the light. So we have the fairy queen of the light is here to shed light onto any situation. And we also got motivation. So for a lot of my cancers, this is where main and motivated. Some of y'all are a little unmotivated right now. And we also got wish wisely. So we have used your wishes to manifest your heart's desire and to take practical steps towards making your dreams come true. And we also got the tree of wisdom. So, and then we also have fine balance. So we got fine balance between your work, rest, and playtime, and you will have more energy. So that's going to be important for you too, right? And then we also have wait for the winter. So during the coldest months of the Fairy Queen will help you manifest your most heartfelt wishes as long as your intentions are for the highest good of all. And we also have moderation. So that's going to be important as well. So we have, is there something that you shouldn't be eating? Try, you know, being mindful and healthy, although the fairies have showed you something different. So maybe this is just changing up your diet a little bit. And we got faith and wisdom. So for a lot of my cancers, that's going to be extremely important as well. You know, keeping that faith that, you know, spirit is working for you regardless of the circumstances or regardless of what you're going through. They're telling you to trust the process. Let's see what else is coming in right now. So we do got the angel of the white light, which indicates a new beginning. And we got the angel of enlightenment. Somebody could be 33. So it looks like something's being brought to the light. And we also have the angel of channeling. So this is calling in exactly what you are wanting from spirit, right? Somebody could be 26. And then we have the angel of stress and the angel of healing. Somebody could be, somebody got a three-year-old and somebody could be 25. So that's going to be extremely important for a lot of y'all as well. You know, take what energy resonates and leave what doesn't. So we got the angel of fertility. Somebody could be 28 and somebody got a nine year old. And we also have the angel of knowledge. So this is receiving clarity about your situation, cancer. And this is your guardian angel coming through for you. Even if you don't see it right now, we got the angel of good news. And we also have the angel of meditation. We got some Pisces energy here. So for a lot of my cancers, remain positive. Even if it's hard, remain positive. Things gonna get better. And we got the angel of the animal realm. And we also have the angel of nature. This is going to connect them with nature. Maybe this is taking a walk through a park or going to a beach. And at the bottom of the deck, we got the career angel. So for some of my cancers, this could be changing careers. You could be leaving your current job and you know going into another field of work. We got visualize abundance in all forms. God gave you such a spiritual gift and a spiritual power that everything that you visualize becomes reality. So this could be through a dream and we got release jealousy. So I'm not saying that you're jealous. You could be, but there's definitely a jealous energy around you. Jealousy is an affirmation that you don't have something. And the universe affirms exactly what you manifest. So be careful with that. And we got partnership. Some of you could be in a jealous partnership or a jealous friendship, whether this is you or that friend or that partner. And we have donations tied in and charitable work. So for a lot of my cancers, give. Right now is the time to give. For those of my cancers that are resonating with this message, if you're on YouTube, you can send a super like. It's your way to support, of course. If you're on TikTok, the CA is pinned. If you are interested in personal services, if you're on TikTok, you can inbox. You can go directly through the booking link. If you're on YouTube, you can go through the booking link as well. You can email or there's more in the description below and also on the community board. We have disturbing this. You are a beloved child of God like everyone else, and you deserve to receive the support that will allow you to focus upon divine life purpose. And we also have attracted, not chasing. So anything or anyone that you chase will run the other way because of underlying fears of chasing energy. Attract what you need by sending out love, gratitude, and welcoming energy. And we have words of abundance. So you have the ability to instantly manifest abundance by choosing powerful and positive words. Always describe your own situation as, you know, in loving and optimistic terms. And that's exactly what you will receive from the universe. And we got the power of prayer. 
So for a lot of my cancers, give the situation to God for uplifting, healing, and be open to miracles. At the bottom of the deck, we are block out distractions. Your life purpose and other priorities need your undivided attention. So it's time to take your charge of your schedule, working environments by turning off electronics or avoiding anyone or anything that distracts you from what is important, cancer. Whether this is cutting off certain people, certain energies, or just cutting ties, period. I appreciate you, Cancer. Thank you.